This is the saw palmetto, Serano repens. And what I like about where I'm located or where I'm shooting this is that there's two forms here. You've got the sort of basic green form and then there's also more of a silver form here. Uh, it's not quite as glaucous or silvery as I've seen some palmetto clumps get, but it's a good way to have a nice contrast between the two uh, expressions that palmetto will produce. So I thought that was worthy of shooting. Um, of course, this is a Florida native, so I like to try to put those in when I can onto my little YouTube channel. It's also a uh, ethnobotanical of sorts. Uh, I guess in recent medicinal history, these, uh, well, for Americans anyway, these uh, palmetto berries, as they're called, have been used um, in complementary or natural medicine, um, and it's indicated uh, as a therapy in one regard for um, uh, prostate issues like hypertrophy of the prostate or uh, benign prostatic hyperplasia plasia, and uh, it's reputed to to, uh, to have therapeutic effects for those issues but uh, clinical science really hasn't backed it up any but anyway I don't judge that so uh, but here's the uh, berries it's kind of sparse on this one here. I don't see a real good cluster of them. But anyway, these things are harvested around October, uh, mid to late September into October, and uh, around here. And their um, price varies from, from the amount of berries that come out. Like right now, I'm not seeing a lot of uh, big flushes of fruit. There's a few other properties that I've been keeping my eye on. Uh, so the price might be a little bit higher this year. I don't know. Uh, one of the other claims for this uh, berry as a therapeutic is uh, uh, as an expectorant. And a friend of mine also claims that it's good for nails. Uh, taken orally, it, I guess, has some effect on nail strengthening. So, anyway, Serano repens, saw palmetto. Uh, and this is a Florida native.